Que pasa, everybody, and happy new year. It is me, Jay Asante, back again for another review. And this time we're looking at from the Takara release of Animated Blackout. Now, as you can see, Blackout here is, of course, an animated, you know, esque helicopter, you know, from the movie line. And it looks really nice. I really do like it. I think it looks really cool. It looks really, really neat. Um, I just like the overall design of it. There's really nothing else to say. Uh, it's got that kind of a gray brown color with some red gold purple silver very nice and no like sparkly uh, metal or die cast pieces which is pretty cool I really like it and so there you go uh, these move up and down as you can see the propel uh, the rotor it spins it doesn't have it's got this plunger but it's not to move this it's actually to shoot this piece back. I'll get into that later on, but uh, it's got no landing gear, and basically this is it. I mean, there's really nothing else to it. It just kind of just sits there, but it still looks really nice, and the helicopter mode is pretty cool looking. Okay, let's get on to the transformation. What we basically got to do is kind of disconnect this piece off, like so. Then what we're going to do is take this piece and bring it all the way down snap it together and which that case this the propeller just shoots out like that you're going to bring the legs down flip up the feet and fold down the heel spurs like so next thing you're going to do is just take these pieces and bring them down and you know what let's just open this up like so see it just close and just opens like that and you just bring it to the back and just kind of clip it to the side like so all right fold the arms down fold the hands out fold the guns forward like so just get them standing let's just fold these pieces back make sure just fold these down all right and here we have animated blackout in robot mode now let's just take a closer look at them let's take a look at the face very nice. I really do like the face, you know. Very cool. It's got painted red eyes, no um translucent eyes and whatnot. Or light piping. And yeah, he basically just very bulky. And you know I like it. I do like the design and it's very close to what the movie character looked like. Which is cool. Very cool. And if you would just turn around like so. Very nice, and if we just turn them around, there we go. See, there's you know the the hollow legs, but overall it's very nice looking. I really do like it. So, you know, once again, the look of him is very cool. Articulation for blackout. His head it doesn't rotate. It's it just stays there. Unfortunately, the arms can go about up to there only because of all the stuff be behind it like that it can go forward can't really go out that much as you can see we could go forward and back uh, it's got a bicep swivel and we need to transfer you know arms can go up like so the hands can also move up but that's due to the transformation and the claws as you can see they do move the two claws He's got waist articulation right there. The legs go forward and back. Out and in. This turns right above the knee and bends at the knee. And the toes, they can move as well, but that's also due to transformation. Now, like I said before, with this part, uh, this is actually his other weapon. What you basically got to do is take one arm kind of fold in the hand and you're just going to let me just also rotate this and you're just going to just just kind of rest it in his hand like so but doing that it does put a lot more weight on the arm and it does kind of tend to flop but there you go and it's got a, the plunger like I said you just shoot it and there it goes. So, so yeah. Uh, 
the plunging weapon. Depends if you'd like it or not. I think it's kind of cool. So, overall, Blackout here is a pretty cool figure. I mean, I really do like him. Um, he's neat. He's got a very nice, simple transformation. The alt mode is very nice looking. The robot mode is, you know, it's short like animated lug nut. And it does have, you know, again with lug nut, the head can't rotate. But it's a very nice figure. The plunger, you know, this this attack weapon gimmick, it's one of the, I think it's more of a case if you're gonna like it or you're gonna hate it. I mean you could take it off and just put it to a side and it really does nothing. So but overall I would recommend this figure and I know a certain uh moon Buddy Moon will really like this figure and will really appreciate it. So yeah, uh so Moon this is but this was basically to show you know a review and you know what moon can expect when he gets this figure so hopefully you enjoyed this review i am jess santi and i will talk to you all later